So uh, the main goal of this class is to take a, a very experienced and excellent biologist and to move it into a level in which this biologist is also able to deal with data, to parse its data, to analyze it, to formulate, formulate the question, and in the end also provide an analytical, very clear uh, understanding of the huge result that were collected in one of the many uh, new technologies that are available now for any uh, kind of biology. It could be molecular biology, genetics, uh, proteomics, or whatever, but in the end of the day, it's all about having the data, understanding it, parsing it, computing it, visualize, analyze, and present. So this is going to be a very hands-on class. So we're going to actually practice. So every lesson we're going to discuss different databases that we might want to work with. So it could be genomic databases like QCC Genome Browser, or it could be proteomic databases like Uniprot, or human variation like uh, CleanVar or the 1000 Genome Project. And then we're also going to talk about different aspects of Python. So it could be just basic programming, so how to work with uh, Python and all the different skills that we need in order to deal with data and to parse it. And then to more biology specific stuff, so how we work with biological sequences when we, uh, when we uh, open files, say, uh, in the Python language. And all the way to more advanced uh, statistical and data processing, visualization, all the different skills uh, that you need to have in order to uh, conduct efficient quantitative biological research in the 21st century. So we're going to try to wrap everything and to add and to make sure that we have all of those skills. So like I said, it's going to be a very, very hands-on class. So on top of all the lectures that you're going to, uh, to see through the videos in this class, you're also going to have access to all the code examples and the notebooks that we're going uh, to demonstrate. And then there are going to also be a lot of exercises that will allow you to take everything that you've learned and to put it into practice. And unlike in many other courses where the exercises are very narrow and deal just with very simple kind of technical stuff, we try to cover not only the technicalities but also the more broad aspects. So our exercises in this course are going to be very broad. We are going to present you with some uh, open-ended biological questions and it's going to be your goal throughout this class to figure out how to take this uh, open-ended question and how to formulate it into a concrete hypothesis and how to write concrete code that will take concrete data and answer these questions. 